hospital not knowing anything. I didn't know I was giving birth. And because of Dr. Carlin and all the nurses, they're the reason they're here. I mean, they were a pound and a half each at birth. They're miracles. I mean, they're an amazing, amazing example of how dedication, love, and medicine could create this. It was really just actually over overwhelming to see so many of our, our babies and teenagers and adults and families that we've worked with over so many years. Every time I talk about it, I choke up. Every time. One pound 11 ounces, three months in the hospital. But thanks to the nurse like Sue, Mary, Teresa. Listen, I can't even remember some of them names. I just have so many wonderful memories and it makes me feel so good that they've grown up and they're happy and they're healthy and we can celebrate the fact that you know, we did it together, right guys? Yeah, we did it together. They were not supposed to be born early and it was a big surprise. The NICU was really great for us. They took really good care of them. They were born at 32 weeks and they were there for five very long weeks. The nurses were amazing. It's pure gratitude. I, I held back tears, but uh, <laughs> it's, it's so nice to see. And there are no words to describe how much we owe them and how grateful we are. great to see all our graduates who have grown up and become older children, young adults. So it's really amazing to see the work that we do and how great the kids end up when they go home. It's not, it, we don't get to see the development every day of these babies when we're in the NICU, but it's really nice to see them afterwards and how much they've grown. It's strengthening. It makes it able to take the phone calls in the middle of the night, to rush in, to leave family on friends on the weekends or the holidays, to know that you had such an impact on people, to be so thankful. So it's really strengthening to help keep us going day in and day out.